worked super hard on the creative map, done everything you need to do, get every edit you need to make, and you published it. But Epic Games has completely rejected it just out of nowhere. They've just said rejected on the creative portal page and you can't publish it. Well, this is how to, to not get rejected. Okay, so. I'm going to make this video short and sweet, but I'm going to remind you that if you do enjoy it, like the video, and also if you want to become a pro player, check down the link in the description. Trust me, it's worth it. You can see this is where the map is published, and you can see it's been failed, because if you put in your update through, it'll, let's say, fail right here under the content review. If it comes through, it'll say regional restrictions, or it'll say just fine. Um, you head down into the email, and it'll look something like this. It'll say island rejected, Fortnite created portal, and it'll be a small email. Not entirely helpful, but there is a bit of it that's helpful. All of this is just copy pasted, and all of this has been copy pasted. But this part is the important part. Please address the following issues, then publish a new release using the creator portal. Keep it authentic, my one was. That was the issue with the map and why it wasn't published. What this basically means is it's a super small issue, but a super common issue with creative maps. And this might even be the reason that yours has been rejected. So basically, it is all about false advertising and so when the thumbnail image or the title or the description or even text in the map describes something that might not entirely be true it can cause this to flag up so this could be the term zero delay they've been cracking down on that one for a while now so if your map has zero delay in the title zero delay on the text in the map that might be considered a violation and it'll pop up here so you'll have to re redo the map delete that and then publish it again this one's a pretty small change, but it can be hard to identify. I've had times that I've literally had to go around and had to um, delete something, then try again, it's not worked. Delete something, then try again, it's not worked. You've just got to find something that's promoting something, or whether it's promoting V-Books, fake V-Books, fake XP gains, fake zero delay. You can just keep it, you know, make sure none of those terms are in it. Another one I've had before is code. So promoting your creator code is not allowed, which is really weird because it is literally the same payout system as the creator code, but you're not allowed to promote one over to the other. I think it's just so all my money or whatever, but if you have use code something, in my case, it'd be use code JKC to use it. But if you have that in your map, it'll flag up and it won't allow you to publish it. You can see this one I had a pretty big issue with over here. I had one or more instructional bullet points that would keep it authentic, the description, the promotional image, and the title. This was because I had an issue with the zero delay aspect. It was zero delay, so they were like, nope, nope, nope. Everywhere it says zero delay, we cannot allow that. Anyway, this email mail, you just have to know where to look. If you start looking at all of the other parts, it's not going to be good. And you can see we also have island content disclosures. So if you filled out your age rating form wrong, i.e. you've not said the shooting in it or not said there's a voice chat in it, then it can also remove your island. So you can see all of the stuff in here. There's actually a whole rule guide over here. Everything in here, it will be under one of these clauses. So I'm gonna put this link in the description and also make sure you check your emails, guys. Come on, chop chop. It literally tells you what's wrong. Not in very much detail, but it tells you what's wrong. You can change it. And if you believe that there's literally nothing wrong with your map, then you can appeal it or you can move one thing, literally a centimeter across, then save it again and then publish it and see what happens. It could have just been a glitch. That being said, guys, I appreciate every single one of you. Make sure you click on this video right here. It is a banger. And also, what are you doing? Subscribe to the channel. We're on our way to 16,000. Love you all in a bit. Hope you found it useful.